hello guys welcome back in today's video i'll be showing you how i achieve a five minutes makeup look i'll be starting off in priming my face and i'll be using my laura mercier hydrating primer just to let you know i've done my skincare and uh, please make sure that you do your skincare before you apply any makeup on your skin I'll be going in with my Lancome Tint Idol All Over Concealer. This is in shade 10.3. Conceal here, here. I'm concealing the places I have discoloration because you can, you can see. Let me zoom you in so you can see properly. You can see I have discoloration, a little bit of darkness around my mouth. So I just want to conceal this around my mouth area take my sponge this sponge is already it's damped okay damped not wet damped sponge start blending this is same brand concealer Lancome all over concealer but this is in a different shade this is in shade 9 I'm going to be using this shade to conceal under my eyes okay applying just tiny dots here and here okay dots and dots okay so our application should be something like this if I'm looking up because it's my viewfinder so <laughs> so if you find I can see myself just making sure that I'm sure that your application is something like this You don't want to apply too much because this is five minutes. You want to apply something that can apply that you can blend out so quickly and Be out of the door. Okay, and I'll start blending under my eyes Let me zoom you in Okay, you can see the difference. So this is the conceal on the right, and this is the one I have not blended out yet. You can see just it just lifted the eye as well. This Lancome concealer, all over concealer. Love, love, love this concealer. You can see I have it in three different shades because I love it. It's such a good concealer. Make sure when you're doing this sort of step, you get a good concealer that this you know that's not too too not too too heavy but still gives that will give you that coverage that you're looking for but without looking so heavy on your face okay so i'll be using the shade 051 to highlight so just put a dot like this okay a dot here this concealer should be three three four shade lighter <laughs> than my skin tone so but that's what I like. You don't have to do this step if you don't want. You can just stop with concealing, then you can go on with your powder. But me, I love a well <laughs> highlighted under eyes, okay? And I start blending. And I'm just keeping it right here at the under eye. Can you see? I'm not I'm not dragging it, I'm just keeping it below the eyes, okay? Just keeping it down here. So I'm using my Derma Blend Loose Setting Powder, and this is in shade Warm Saffron to set much. Okay, and dust up the excess in my palm setting. Take again what's under my what's in my palm. Okay, from the powder that I dusted on my palm, picking up from there and set around my mouth. Okay, and um, around my nose because I tend to get a bit shiny on my nose, so I'll just set it slightly. 
there's barely any powder in this i'm just using what's left and i didn't like you saw i didn't pick up any other powder i'm just using what is was already on my palm okay because the goal is to look like you haven't got makeup on but you have makeup on okay I'm going to pick up my powder again, okay? I'm using my same powder, the Demon Blood Loose Setting Powder in shade Warm Saffron. So I'm just going to take this much powder, okay, to set around my, to set my smile line because I tend to crease on my smile line. Just push it into my smile line like this, okay? But this will help our smile line to kind of stay inside during the day picked another pout a little small bit of powder here on my sponge and i'm just going to use it to kind of slightly bake under my eye just to avoid if you have lines under your eye this is a good trick if you don't skip this skip this step but if you do this is a good trick take a little bit of loose setting powder and just place it on there to help your under to stop your under eye from creasing or to stop the concealer from you know setting into your into the lines under your eyes this is a good trick to do okay to take my brush and just dust off any excess spot under my eyes but yeah so if i can leave it like this you can leave it like this and just take your setting spray and set it and go okay but because I'm extra, I'm going to apply a little tiny bit of blush on my cheeks, okay? For blush, I'll be using my Glossier Liquid Blush, okay? This is in shade Storm. Love, love this blush. A little bit goes a long way, but I love just dot like, just a little dot like this on the cheek, okay? Will do. This is, because I just want a little bit of blush on my cheek. Again, you don't have to do this step. If you don't like blush, just stop with where you know with the concealer and set and go about your business because i like to be extra and obviously i love makeup <laughs> and i just want a little bit of flush on my cheeks so that's why i'm going in with the blush okay so i'll take the sponge i'll use a different side i haven't got any products on it to blend it And just use what's left on the sponge and just put it on your nose like so. You can barely see it. Okay. Just bring it under your eyes like this. Just, I've just zoomed you in so you can see what the face is looking like. Okay. So you can see we have our concealer, we have the powder, and the blush. Just you can barely see it, but you can see just a little bit of that um color on the cheek which is lovely I apply quick lip product on my lips you can go on and apply i've already got a lip balm which is this body shop uh, vitamin e lip balm on i've got it on now but i want to apply just a little bit of lipstick and lip line on, on my lips again you don't have to do this step if you don't want to you can just apply your lip balm and go so i'll be using my mac lip liner in shade chestnut can see it's almost <laughs> finishing this lip liner is really good the brown lip liner Revlon this is Revlon, Revlon um, cream lipstick I'm using my benefit clear brow gel to set my brow quickly yeah i love this look i love it because it just makes your skin look so good 